the conversation, at least the topic, was yesterday a caller called me and based on something he thought I said or something I actually said, he asked me what I thought the responsibility of the woman at home was. Meaning that the implication of the question suggests that a woman has a place. And as someone who is free, a man will not give me a place. Like he would not assign a place to me. Where I will be is anywhere that I choose. So if I choose not to cook for you, it's a choice it is. And the consequences I will take. A choice that I've made personally. So I thought it was wild when he said to me, your pl is your place not in the kitchen? So first of all, you have to understand that there was no problem prior to that moment. And then came the imposition of his arrogance, which heaven will not permit me to tolerate personally. So I want to believe that women, so I don't know what women think about it. So I, I think on one hand that women accept that they have a place, but maybe what women should do for us today is tell us whether this place was a choice of their own or it was something that was given to them. And if they could, that they would change it. So here's something. If you are giving something and given choice, you would change it. Then it begs reviewing. You know, it begs reviewing. Like if you had more, if you had, I don't have a problem with cleaning and cooking. Well, I think if you use a plate, you wash it as common sense. If a place is dirty, you clean it. So what I've noticed that arrogance does is arrogance suggests that the responsibility of cleaning and cooking is, is beneath another position. And that other position is the one that the man occupies. So that is exactly what I contend with. I contend. So if you suggest to me that there is something beneath you, then I couldn't touch that thing because I would not touch anything. I wouldn't deign touch a thing that's beneath you because if it's beneath you, it has to be beneath me. He said, women choose, you, you have the power to choose who to submit to. Right? I wasn't forced to be a Christian. I chose to be a Christian. And I choose to submit to God mm -hmm. on a daily basis. The day I don't choose to submit to God, I face the consequences, whatever that might be or not be. So my own thought, because if I if I say I should deal with this, I, look, I don't like I said once, I don't I don't like to, you know, confront men or anybody like that. Just don't stand in my way. Because that's when you see something that is when, when your water will pass your gari. Yeah, then, but but then, you see, yeah, would you would you use like your water will pass no? Your pardon me. So so here is what what I would I don't know. Think about it again. Would you use violence when you can use reason? Because if you had reason, then nobody would even be in your way. Because they might they must really show you that the God of truth is okay with the suppression of one sex. And that only and that and that submission as a law only applies to one sex. You so know what, I don't think I you mean, need maybe violence. You're, maybe you maybe you're a better woman than I am. No, I'm no, saying. I'm just not going to take I, it. That's I don't have time. Okay. I don't have the time to be reasonable with an unreasonable person. Oh, wow. That's just the truth. Said, right, I think know. the problem is house choice and betting children have been seen as demeaning. Sorry, he thinks that house chores and birthing of children, children. have been seen as demeaning. as demeaning. So it's not demeaning, but some men in their arrogance have demeaned it. So, for example, I cook the food that I eat as a single woman. Yeah. The guy who said to me, your place is in the kitchen, would come to my house. And if there is food, he eats. Yeah. So one day he said to me, I'm coming to your house to eat. And I said, no. You know, because I was in love, I was still thinking maybe we'll just see a slight miss. Maybe he misaligned his sentence. You know, he misplaced his words. And I said, no, you're coming to see me. Then when you come, if there's food, then you'll eat. But when you put it like that, you are saying to me to get to leave what I'm doing. And that because you are coming, I should go and cook. And I said, that's not right. I was still thinking it was a case of, Language, what's that English subject? Is it language and structures? Uh, uh, there's, a, there's a module in English. Lexis and structure. Something and structure. Oh, come on, child, you forgot. Well, there's something, you know, structure. Uh -huh, something grammatical structure. And he said, no. That he said he's coming to eat. And I said, no, if you're hungry, you have to go to a restaurant 
to eat. Then you come. But you're not going to say to me to get up and go and cook. And he said, feminist. Who use I'm swear for now? You know, he said, you feminist. Um, so this is what you guys do, or this is what you've become. Who use I'm swear for now? It's your place, not in the kitchen. So you see, that would never happen. So what I say to you as a person is, a man would not say to me, tell me where my place is. It cannot, like, there are impossibilities in this world. That's one. Imagine everything that you believe is an impossibility. That's one for me. You see? Right. Mm. That's why some people, that a lot of them want their, want, their, want their lady to go to school. School is good, though. It's, right. it's, it's about to introduce school, but... If anything, if in water we are drinking. No, it's, it's not Oyibo that introduced school. No, there's been school. Even in the time of Jesus, there was school. Okay. So, yeah, so, there's so, been so, school. There's been school. Okay, I don't know. I don't know. But if everything is too much, it will be too, too affecting. At least, some things, I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying your program, but there's some things. I'm not enjoying it because the book is too much. You are going, you are going I'm going much mad. Because that, yeah. You, you're going to eat it will affect you as a lady. Adjust more. Adjust. So, so, yeah. No, adjust. no. no. <laughs> you need to adjust. I, Thank you. Yes. I'm, 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 I'm not going to marry. Say, you can bank on that. Uh, yeah. It's so not, not going to work. Adjust. It's too much. No. Uh -huh. So now, so let's talk about something else. You suppose that there is something about marriage that is worth me sacrificing the truth of my soul to have. Now, that's a wrong assumption. My um... There's a reason why God created a woman. If they want to tease themselves, uh -huh. then there's a reason God did what created a woman to do what. Yeah. If they want to ease themselves, they bend down. A man stands. God forbid! Did you say that? Hold on, hold on. A man stands to ease himself while a woman bend. The woman bending doesn't mean that a man should not be treating the woman. You asked that guy from. Ogo State, the way the whites treat the blacks, is that submissive? That's slavery. The difference between being submissive and slavery. Have you, have you, no, no, no. Have you read Willie Lynch, The Making of a Slave? The, not. Have you heard of social conditioning? In what way? How? Where you make people believe what a lie is, but they think that the lie is the truth, and so they accept it. I don't believe in all that. So, I don't so, go with the crowd. You know, so unfortunately, maybe you need to do a little bit more work besides just going with the crowd. Like you need to okay. know these things so that maybe you can, oh, you can, on, no, 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 no. Because I, I think, okay, I think it's okay, so okay, flat. I think it's flat that you say a woman bends down to urinate. What's that? Please just hold on. Don't, you, you are, don't understand the literary expression. Try and understand the idiomatic expression, what I'm talking about. I'm not talking about because they are bending down. Miss this be a slave to the man. No. There's a reason why God created everything. Let's, okay, give simple examples. Even in the whole world today, or even in, okay, let's, we are in Nigeria now. If you want to say something, please act like a man. Be a man. Have you heard someone say be a woman? No. Yeah, but that's a social what, language. What is a social that's language. That's not the truth. I, that's not, what does that mean? Are women courageous? Hold on. Are, are, are there women there who are courageous? Walks. Men yeah, are courageous, what? women are yes. courageous. Men die, so, women die. Men are capable now, of good, women are George, capable of good. George, these days, you women want to now be rubbing shoulders with the men. Guy, no, I'm, it is guy, not possible. Guy, I'm, allow I'm me to say, I'm probably, I'm probably you know greater why? than you. Is it possible not, that I'm greater than I, you? Joyce, why I know you very, No, very no, no, well. my friend, hold on, wait, wait. Let, let's just, let's have a friendly conversation, wait. Is okay. it possible that I'm greater than you? Is it possible? It's possible, sure. But you said no two minutes ago, and that's why I brought it but back. But no, but no, as I'm talking to you, you might have lived in Italy, whatever, and everything. No, that's not what I mean. You are not greater than me, Joyce. Okay, so you are not. so are you greater than me? In some extent, in some aspect, I am. Where? In what aspect but are you? In, in, in what? No, no, it's okay. I it's am. okay. It, it, oh, in generally, you're greater than me. Yes, it's laying down facts. I'm okay, Okay. so you. in what areas? I think you must know the areas where you are greater than me, yeah? So yes, what, what are the areas? I no, I know, I know, it's okay, but they must have a okay. name. Okay. So okay. in what okay. areas are you greater than me? I know to you, 
upstairs there, you might know, you might be brilliant. No, don't play my intelligence no, down, honey. I'm not pl- okay, okay. No, don't, pl- don't say, don't okay, say Joyce. I might think, I might know. One day what I, I am is what that, I am. Okay, 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 let me not give you. I am a British citizen. What does that mean? That don't make you greater okay, than now, me. I know, it's generally, if you comprise everything, I know I am greater than you. Oh, hold, wait, wait, wait. You're a British citizen. I wait, wait, wait. You're a British. On, wait, hold on a second, please. Hold. Wait. I know. I hold on. Let me understand you. And employ you and pay you. Yeah, but you I'm haven't done it. You. So wait a second. But you don't know that I can't do it. I have the experience. You don't know that I can't build a radio station. That I haven't you bragged about why, it don't mean that I can't do it. Men are placed where they are placed. You are not meant to be rubbing shoulder with everyone. No, now, hold on. Wait, now. So, except you're saying that if you tell me okay. something, I should keep quiet. Because okay. if you say you're a British citizen, you're okay. implying that the British are superior to the black people. People who colonize you. Are, are superior yes, to the black people? You. Yes. We, we, we colonize you. Yes. Okay. Isn't it? Yeah, yeah. You know what? You're right. You're right.